for our comprehensive exams and to increase employment, employment needs has been started in all the career centers. My government is committed to improve the ease of doing business and the government has made services like approval of plan rights, registration and licensing of practice, renewal of practice and boiler's license online through Swagat, single window, approval by all government agencies in Tripura portal. My government has enrolled 8.6 lakhs unorganized workers in the ESLAM portal to provide the social security benefits under different state and central states. My government has allotted and hand over 5 acres of land at free of cost to ESA Corporation at the Oduji Nagar industrial area for setting up of 100 federated ESA hospital which was approved by ESA Corporation Minister of Labor and Planning. My government has launched a project Mukti for enabling the finance of drug and other substances abuse under Legal Aid Defense Council system the scheme 2,118 cases have been handled since inception in 2022. My government under the Pradhan Mantri Awas Yojana Grami has completed 74,000 houses during 23-24 with an expenditure of 1,369 crores. The focus on creation of income generating assets to valuable venerable households, the implementation of the Mahatma Gandhi National Rural Employment Guarantee Scheme has resulted in generation of generation of 3.03 crores per Sundays with an outlay of rupees 815.37 crores up to 7th December 2023. With a view to preserve water for the future under Mission Amrit Sarovar as a part of celebrations of the Adhavika Amrit Mahotsu, my government has ensured the completion of at least 75 Amrit Sarovars in each district as per the mandate of the government of India. During the last, during the last five years, under Dindaya Antunaya Yojana National Rural Livelihood Commission, around 47,600 self help groups have been benefited. Under the Dindaya Upadhyaya Ramina Kausalya Yojana scheme, skill training has been started for 16,169 rural youth, of whom 12,800. 63 have been completed the training. My government aspects to transform 12 most backward blocks across the state. Total 555 fish farmers belonging to ST communities have been provided with the input support for integrated big country farming with financial involvement of 111. Lacks. To promote quality education, my government has approved for setting up of two private universities, namely Techno India University, Tripura at Anandanagar, Agartala, and the Aryabhat International University, Tripura at Dharmanagar. These three new government degree colleges have been started. From the academic year 22 23, Vidya Pradhan dashboard has been launched by Honorable Chief Minister Dr. Manik Shah on 21 July 2023 for 125 Vidya Pradhan schools. Two artificial intelligence labs are running at two schools. During the year 23 24, 
smart classrooms have been introduced in 812 schools. My government has started the procurement of padding since December 2018. Now padding is being procured by Sevilla. This year we have already started the padding procurement since 11 December 2023. Up to Paris marketing season 22 23 first crop. A total of 1.75 metric tons of paddy has been procured in the state with an involvement of 336 crores. My government has so far provided 6125 displaced group families with Anjoga and Ayodhana racial crops. Under Mujamantri, Charles Sahariya Kanjan Prakalpa, Ramit Kanjan Prakalpa, so far 1188 free garden workers families have been provided with priority household category ration cards under National Food Security Act. The Mujamantri Kusti Bukhar is implemented by my government under which uh, each eligible pregnant woman gets 2,000 rupees in four installments after each anatomical checkup. So far, 9,428 pregnant women have got benefits under this scheme. My government has enhanced the rate of social pension scheme to 2,000 per beneficiary per month. We have also launched a new state social assistance program named the Mukhya Mantri Samit Sahayata Patalpa for ensuring a secure life with dignity for the economically disadvantaged section of the society. During 2023 24 AIDS and other appliances have been distributed to 6043 dividends including senior citizens. To support these transgender persons and uh, look after their welfare, the Tripura Transgender Welfare Board for Rehabilitation and Welfare of Transgender Persons has been constituted. The Ministry of Women and Child Development has approved two projects under Vakshalya Kalam, an integrated complex for children who Child Welfare Committee, Juvenile Justice Board, Observation Board, Social Board, and Place of Safety with a total cost of rupees 8.55 crores. My government is interested in the all round development of sports in the state. The Electric Racial Policy 2022 has been in force for guiding state transportation sector towards electric vehicle based mobility to achieve the target of having 10% of all types of vehicles to be electric vehicle during the planned period of 5 years. Under Pradhan Mantri Awas Yojana, a total 82,132 houses have been sanctioned and 62,327 houses have been completed till date. Agartala Smart City has taken up the work of constructing four lanes of airport road from Lichu Bagan to new airport terminal with an estimated cost of 96.17 crores. Renovation of Ujayanta Palace Garden with a cost of rupees 37.5 crores. LDB College Lake uh, Revitalization with a cost of rupees 32.31 crores. ATD 8 MLD sewerage treatment plant at uh, ICP Apura with a cost of 24.73 crores under Agatala Smart City. Mukhyamantri Satellite Town Development Scheme has been started to meet new organization challenges with an aim to develop new satellite towns at Agatala, Udaipur and Dharmanagar. 
urban infrastructure across the state with an outlay of 1500 crores with, uh, over the next uh, five years by matching SQI Tripura Urban Employment Program Scheme. To become more citizen friendly, various services have been made online, like the online building plan, permission, online property tax payment, permission for fixing voting, online trade license, new and renewal septic tank clearance, water tank equation, and uh, thousands. My government is committed for overall development of the indigenous people of the state. And with this move, Chief Minister's Travel Development Mission, focusing on education, health and nutrition, sanitation, drinking water, livelihood, etc., was launched on 15th November 2023 on the occasion of state level Janagadi of Gaurav Divas with their sanction of rupees 30 crores. My government has provided free metric scholarship to 15,717 ST students, uh, 100 ST beneficiaries have been provided with the power dealers and 90 beneficiaries have been provided with auto rickshaws under one time financial assistance scheme. 320 ST students have been benefited. 10,042 ST students have been covered through 413 centers under the scheme of special coaching in four subjects in 2023. Under the Chief Minister's Rappler Mission, 17,820 beneficiaries have been benefited, covering 14,011.66 hectares rubber plantation. Under the Pradhan Mantri Vandran Yojana, 25 Vandran Vikas Kendras have been sanctioned. During the financial year 2324, an amount of rupees 509 crores has been placed to the Tripura Tribal Area Autonomous District Governments. My government has further taken a joint lead in the delegation of the government offices by adopting the office since my since May 2023. All the offices of the district magistrate have implemented the office successfully with offices of the subdivisional magistrates and block development officers being in the pipeline. By Evo Digital Transformation as a part of food governance, my government is grasping to achieve the uphill cost set by the Honorable Prime Minister. Narendra Modi, India is approaching its goal to reduce carbon emissions by 50% by 2023. In the days to come, my government shall prioritize several good government initiatives <coughs> to empower local governments, skill development and employment generation, women empowerment and social welfare, infrastructure development and environment conservation for holistic and sustainable development. Agriculture and allied sector is one of the dominant sectors in the state, contributing 36% value to the gross state domestic product. For increasing the production and productivity of paddy crop, Mukhyamantri Integrated Crop Management Program has been implemented. My government has supported 21.14 crores as the farmer's share of premium, resulting in cumulative of 12.76 lakh farmers having been insured under Pradhan Mantri Fasal Bima Yojana. <coughs> a total of 329,860 Kisan credit cards have been issued and 1,649 crores have been dispersed during the period. Gargar KCC Ajahn is going on to bring the left of PM Kisan farmers under KCC coverage. My government has also opened 
32 Nishak Bandhu Kendras distributed 28,800 different modern farm missionaries and established 375 farm missionary banks to facilitate the rural farmers to increase their earnings. My government has put top priority on the commercial marketing of horticultural produce and at the same time the government has focused on bringing more land under the under cash crop cultivation to raise farmers income. My government has marketed different horticultural commodities for a total quantity, quantity of 14,000 898 metric tons. My government has a plan to establish a center of excellence on citrus at uh, Taibu Market. Center of uh, excellence at uh, Lembucha. My government aspires to make the state self-sufficient in the production of animal derived food products to meet the nutritional needs of the population. Total 144 small tax units have been developed under Mukhya Mantri Rani Sampar Vikas <coughs> My government has taken up a comprehensive program to increase the level of fish product, productivity by way of input support for scientific aquaculture provided to 63,000 fish farmers with financial involvement of 983 lakhs. Of the 
esteemed members, I would like to extend my greetings to the members of the ISRO on behalf of the people of the cross I extend my heartfelt gratitude to the government of India for launching the Prime Minister Janajati Arivas Yayama Mahakaryan with a budget of around Rs. 24,104 crores to improve the socio-economic conditions of the particularly vulnerable tribal groups. The Union government has also approved a central sector scheme for providing 15,000 crores to the selected women self-help groups with an outcome of Rs. 1,241 crores for the period from 24, 25 to 25, 26 for providing central services to farmers for agriculture purposes. With sustained focus on inclusive growth, last May delivery, use of renewable technology, all of you will contribute your best as the representatives of the people in this August house, keeping in mind your experience of public life and uh, the experience of the people, expectations of the people. In fact, I believe that the current session of the house will be conductive and will uphold the values towards the formulation of people-centric policies and schemes. I would like to conclude my address with an important quote. अभी हमारे मोरनीय प्रधानमंत्री श्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी जी एक ही उक्ति उचितों को रे हमार भक्तों को शेष करती आम्रा एक साथे हट बो आम्रा एक साथे चोर बो आम्रा एक साथे भागो आम्रा एक साथे समक्षार समाधान Korbo, Ebon, Amra Ek Sate, Amade, Maha Deske, Egye, Egye, Jaro. I have only read the key points. The full text will be presented to you. I wish you and the people of the state all the best once again for the ownership of property, etc. My government has reduced the rate of stamp duty for women or women category to 4% in registration of documents. My government has declared wild animal attack and forest fire as the state-specific disaster. My government with an eye on ease of living of the citizens has started online services related to land reports. Under my government, uh, the state is able to meet the full peak of our demand with the power generated from the state as well as central sector college in BSU, OTPC and uh, NIPCO, including short-term power purchase on real-time basis. The state has formed a state transmission unit narrating Tripura Power Transmission Limited which is the first company in the country of its kind to incorporate sub-transmission system of 33 kg level. My government has provided 5.51 lakh functional outdoor tap connection, tap water connections in the rural area, which is 73.74% of rural households. The state of Tripura is uh, having Six national highways with a total length of 923.31 kilometers and uh, four in principle declared national highways for a length of 229.25 kilometers. The total valuable land in the state of Tripura is 2,55,241 hectares, out of which 1,20,625. 
Oh. 